हेलो एवरीवन वेलकम टू आरोग्य फिजियो टिप्स प्लीज सब्सक्राइब टू आर चैनल एंड डोंट फॉरगेट टू रिंग द बेल टुडे वी आर बैक विद अ वेरी वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट वीडियो दैट इज वर्किंग फ्रॉम होम एवरीवन इज वर्किंग फ्रॉम होम इवन द चिल्ड्रन आर स्टार्टिंग फ्रॉम होम एंड एवरीबडी इज ऑन लैपटॉप ऑन सिस्टम so it is very very important right now to maintain the posture so this video is about eight tips to maintain the posture while you are working or studying at home so it is for both for corporate people who are working from home and for the students as well today raksha will be demonstrating all the um, tips for us so raksha also spends a lot of time in front of laptop so we thought she will be perfect for us to demonstrate all these tips so eight tips about working from home all will be demonstrated by raksha so while you are working at home it is very important that you listen to your body your body will give you signs that it is not okay suddenly you will have pains and aches or you will feel discomfort you can just stretch around while you are at chair itself we have a video that exercises in the chair you can actually go through those videos or you can you know take a complete support or something so for example if you have pain in the middle back you can actually put a small pillow and give yourself a support maybe stretch back a little and then again be aware of your posture and start working again so it's very important that you should listen to your body tip number 1 listen to your body the second very important tip is be very very conscious of your posture when we are working in the system we suddenly start going forward we slouch our shoulder forward we put our neck in flexion that means again little bit of bend which should not happen at all as soon as you realize that you are not in correct posture it is very very important to correct your posture so roll your shoulder back and tuck your chin in and again start from a correct posture what is correct posture is when your ear shoulder and hip all the three fall in one single line so second tip is be conscious of your posture the third very very important uh, point is get up and move around office so whenever you feel that 30 to 40 minutes you have been continuously sitting it's good to stretch little bit maybe move around because it improves your circulation maybe just move around in your room or if you want to go out go out whatever whatever suits you how much ever time you have just move around if you are a person who just forgets that you know there is so much of work and you're not able to get up then put an alarm every 30 and 40 minutes and it is good to move around fourth very important tip is keep everything you need to work within your arm reach because if it is not within your arm reach there are chances that you may stretch and get into a wrong posture for example if the mobile was near uh, raksha then she would have not stretched her hand and taken the mobile if her bottle is near her she will not stretch and do it so everything you require whether it's bottle pen paper or mobile or even fruit try to keep it within your arm reach and as close to you as possible so that you can avoid all the wrong postures tip number 4 that is keep everything you need to work within your arm reach fifth very important point is use your eye muscles more than neck somehow when we are working on system we always use neck muscles and we flex the neck that means we bend the neck more no you can actually use eye muscles and you can see why your neck is straight so be consciously work on your eye muscles more than the neck muscles your neck should be tuck your chin in should be your mantra while you are working in systems and you should use your eye muscles more if you feel that your eyes are getting tired then what you can do is you can just rub your palm and you can cup your eyes okay even you can move uh, it in circle with the tips of your finger circle clockwise as well as anti clockwise this gives a very calming effect to your eyes so fifth very important tip is use eye muscles more than neck muscles tip number 6 is 
use phone headset. So generally when the phone is coming, uh, we tend to use the phone in a very very wrong posture. Okay. So when you are consciously knowing that you are in a wrong posture, it is generally you take your neck to the sides or uh, neck to the front or anything like that, there will be pain on the other side of the neck. If you get aware about it, then immediately shift onto the headset. So if you are using phone, make sure it is always attached to the headset. Even the clarity of the voice is also much better with the headset use. So if you are working from home and using phone, use it with headset so that your neck posture is absolutely okay. So sixth point is use headset. Seventh very important point is staying hydrated. When we are working from home, sometimes we forget that we need to drink enough water and we tend to get dehydrated by the end of the day which may cause calf pain and all. So that's why it is very important to maintain your hydration. I would suggest that every 40-45 minutes you can put an alarm or something which reminds you about that you need to drink water and take break. Eighth very important point is, so when you are taking break to uh, move around or uh, to have water, it is very good to get up and stretch a bit. Your body is just in one place for very very long time, almost 6, 7, 8 hours. So when you are taking break every 40-45 minutes, it's better to stretch a bit. You can um, do lower limb stretches, upper limb stretches, spine stretches. We have already upper limb and lower limb stretches in our uh, earlier videos. You can actually go through them and do any of those stretches. So this is our eighth tip that is take break to stretch. If you follow all these eight points, I am sure you can maintain your posture well while working from home or while studying from home. So as I said, Raksha demonstrated all the 8 tips and I would request all of you working from home or studying from home, all the small kids who are studying from home, please maintain that 8 tips are completely tick mark every single day so that you are hydrated, you are happy, you are stressed out and that way your posture will be maintained. So witness your fitness and don't forget to ring the bell and subscribe to our channel Arogya Physio Tips. If you want to consult us then you can we have a clinic Arogya Physiotherapy Clinic which is uh, situated in Gotigere. You can come and consult us as well.